Grouping. Open the Pages tab of your query and click on Create Page. Now you will see the Query Page menu in front of you. By moving the cursor over the page, you can see the nature and use of each query type on the right. The grouping query type is suitable for classifying phenomena or their backgrounds. For example, a suitable function for eDelphi is to evaluate the background factors of a research subject using an expert panel. Click on the option. Enter the title of your query in the title field. Write your question in the thesis field and write the explanation or the background information in the bottom text field if necessary. Below the text fields, you will see the default settings of your query. You can edit the settings by clicking on Show Options. From Groups, you will define the category of your choice. To add categories to be grouped, click on Add option. Name the categories on the reserved rows. You can delete a category by clicking the cross next to a row. From items, you will define the phenomena and qualities to be grouped. You can add options by clicking on the label Add Option. Write the options in the reserved rows. You can delete an option by clicking the cross next to a row. This is how grouping will look like. On the left side, you can see the phenomena which the panelists will drag the category boxes on the right. At the bottom of the page, you can define if the question is visible and commentable and whether the conversations are also visible to other panelists. Remember to save your query.